15-year-old Adrian Rose is determined to showcase his skills on the football field. I've been practicing a little bit every day. Competing in the NFL punt, pass, kick, which is one of the world's largest youth sports programs and dates back to 1961, making it the oldest NFL youth football program. It goes back a ways. It goes back uh, all the way to when Brent Favre and uh, Dan Marino uh, competed in this uh, competition. So that there's some of the guys that actually played in the NFL that went through the pump, pass, and kick event. Yes, anytime you compete, you give your all. We gotta come out here to win. Have fun, but win. And that's exactly what future Hall of Famer Peyton Tatum came to do. He wants to win his age division, but has a much bigger dream in mind. I really want to play in the NFL. The Irving Police Department, Police Athletic League, and Problem Solving Unit teamed up to host this event. A popular attraction in the city that allows the youth to see police officers in a different light. You know, it's very important, especially with a lot of incidents that has happened previously, such as Dallas, Louisiana, you know, different things like that. Uh, we think this is very important to reach out to the community, let them know that we care. We're not trying to build any type of wall between us and the community. We need them for everything to work, just as the community needs us. Participants are divided up by age and judged on their skill level. We take boys and girls between the age of 6 and 15 years old. It's free to participate. All that we have to do is fill out a waiver form that's provided by the NFL and also the police department. Once they complete that, they can compete. 89 point something feet. I honestly did not think I was going to get that far. It wasn't just the boys showing off for the judges. The girls earned top scores on the gridiron, too. How'd you do? I think I did good. Good? You think you beat your age group? Mm-hmm. Yeah? Destiny Bryant is beating the odds when it comes to playing football. I want to say that girls are capable of doing a lot of things that boys can do. Girls can prove boys wrong. Boys aren't the only ones that can play football. People think you can't play or anything. I've done that. They're like, you can't play that. You're a girl. It doesn't really matter what you are. Like, I'm, I'm better than my brother, and he's a boy. This is not a battle of the sexes. The program gives an equal opportunity to both boys and girls competing individually. The NFL punt pass kick program consists of four rounds. Locals, which is happening right now at Sam Houston Middle School, Sectionals will be in Southlake and regionals will be held at the Cowboys Stadium. The ultimate goal for these participants is to make it all the way to Orlando, Florida. First place winners are the only winners that advance to the next round. So if you win first place here at the local, you go to the sectionals round. If you make it all the way through, get to the fourth round, which is nationals, the grand prize would be that the NFL will pay for one parent and that child this year to fly out to Orlando, Florida, where they will compete before the Pro Bowl. From here, I want to go to regionals, then go to nationals. Uh, we're trying to make it to an NFL game with me taking whoever goes. Anybody that goes, I'm the number one sponsor. I'm going, so. And with the help of the Irving Police Department, these young athletes will fly first class to the big leagues. Amshi Stephenson for City Source.